Hey everybody, welcome to class. What we're going to focus on today is we're going to focus on vocabulary when it comes to humor. Okay, so you'll learn a lot about different uh, vocabulary words when it comes to humor. I think we're also going to have some times so we'll cover sarcasm. I know a lot of students have always enjoyed uh, the sarcasm class, so we'll do that as well. Okay, and let's see who's here. Hi, Mohammed. Hello, how are you? Hey, doing well. How are you, Mohammed? Fine, thank you. Good, good, good. So, are you ready for a class on humor? We're yes. learning about some humor words. Okay, good, good, good. How's the um? How do you like the reservations? Do you like the reservations? Do you like the reservation system on um on Verbling? Yes, uh, it's the second time for me, uh, the second class here. Oh, second class here. Okay, good, good, good. And where are you from? Uh, I'm from Yemen, but I'm living in Germany. You're in Germany? Yes. Oh, wow. Wow. Sprechen Sie Deutsch? Yeah, I can Deutsch sprechen. <laughs> good. Good for you. Good for you. And now English as well. How many languages um, do you speak? Uh, I'm not a speaker for Arabic. Mm -hmm. And uh, I learned English at school. Uh, do you understand me? Yeah, I'm listening to you. I understand you perfectly. Uh -huh. uh, uh, but when I came to, to Germany, I started to learn uh, German. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, good. Good, good. And then you, you've learned English before, but haven't practiced it enough. Got it. Yes. Got it. Got it. Well, good. Good. Let me see who else is here as well. Nice. Very nice to meet you, Mohammed. Hello, uh, Omar. Mm, it's Nihan, better. Uh, how do I, Nihan? Uh, yes, Nihan? hello. Okay, Nihan. Hey, Nihan. Now, you've been in my class before, right, Nihan? Uh, I think so. Uh, yeah. At, at once a time. Mm -hmm. Once before, you can say. Once before or at least once before, something like that. Okay, well, good, good, good. Good, and where are you from again? I'm from Turkey. Okay, good. Very good, very good. And uh, one, one second, Mohammed. Everything's okay. No need, no need to apologize. Everything's fine. Everything's perfect. So good, good. Everybody's doing well. Oh, Mohammed. Mohammed, do you? Um, if you hear extra noise, Mohammed, close the verbling window. Okay, Mohammed. Close the verbling window. Leave the um, the hangout window open. Sometimes people hear double voices, but everything's a fine, Mohammed. Okay, no problem. Okay. Hello, Mine. Okay, let's see who else is here. Okay. Hi, uh, Hawani. Hello, teacher. Hey, how are you? I'm fine. And you? Good. Doing well. Doing well. Welcome to class. Uh, Monsif. Hi, Monsif. Okay. Samir. Hello, Samir. Hello, my teacher. How are you? Hey. Good. How are you today? I'm fine. Okay, what good. You? Doing well. Doing well. Welcome to another class. So good. Very good. Good. Let's see us is here. And Hi, teacher. Hello. Hi, Red. How are you today? Doing well. Doing well. Nice little bird there. Is that a little robin or <laughs> what kind of bird is that? <laughs> cool little bird. <laughs> Very nice. Very nice. Uh, hello, Monsif. Hey, I had a problem in uh, my microphone. Now it's okay. Yeah, no problem. No problem. All good. All good. Good to see you again. Good to see you again. Let's see who yes. else is here. Ali. Hello, Ali Al. Ahmed. 
Yeah, pray it. Hey, hey. And I'm sorry, I, I, I said uh, Ali Al, and then I said uh, Ahmed, and I also have uh, Ahmed here, so I'll, 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 st I'll stick with Ali Al. Uh, hi, Ali Al, how are you? I'm fine, thank you, teacher. How are you? Doing well, doing well. And now on to you, Ahmed, how are you today? I'm doing well. And you? Doing well, doing well. Good to see you. Good to see you. So, hey Thanks. guys, is, is the uh, is the verbling chat working for you, or is it is it not working right now, Ahmed? Is it is it loading the chat for is you? Working. The chat is working. Okay. Yeah, and sometimes it doesn't work for for other people. And everybody in the chat. For me, it doesn't work. Yet. Okay. If it, it's not work, you should uh, unload it. In the first time when you enter the class, uh, it's possible to uh, not work. But if you uh, uh, reload it, uh, it will work. Yeah, and also, well, mm -hmm. also too, it depends on um, it depends on uh, the language. Hey, Muhammad, uh, don't don't use the screen capture. Okay, don't use that crap capture thing. Okay, but yeah, what happens? happens actually guys is we are working on translating different languages and sometimes we put a little glitch in the system every once in a while so um, mm -hmm. yeah and your page might be loading where, where are you at Ali where are you from Ali yes I'm from Syria okay Syria okay and what's your native language is it Syrian Arabic. or Ar Arabic okay no, Arabic, Arabic. Okay. Is, yes. okay all right okay good 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 uh, well, not good that's working, but I'll make a note of that, okay? And I see Minet's page is still loading. All right, well, hey. No. No, it's, is it there? Are you there now? Yes, I am here. Okay, good, good, good. Okay. So, all right, everybody. Again, we're going to have this class. I'll just share the screen. This is me, for those of you that haven't seen my face before. Mm -hmm. Okay. But we're gonna, what we're going to do is we're going to work on some vocabulary when it comes to humor. Okay, this vocabulary list is not that long. So is a special treat. People, <laughs> for some people, for some reason, people really love this uh, this sarcasm. I've taught this class before, so we'll also talk a lot about uh, sarcasm. Okay, just be careful using sarcasm. It can be very, very offensive. So be careful. All right, but uh, you should also know about it. Okay, so good. I'm just going to start left to right here. Um, Ahmed, can you read this first one here? Okay. Uh, to grab up, verb to laugh, uncontrollably, uh, uncontrollably, uh, to laugh a lot. Yeah. So this is this is almost like laughing until you cry. Okay. Laugh until you cry is another is another way to put this. This is. This is when you have just like a super, super funny uh, person, you know. Oh, by the, by the way, everybody, those of you that have been in my classes before, sometimes there's weird images that come up. I finally, finally figured out in Google a setting to uh, to make sure that this safe search, okay. And I'm, I'm sorry. I, I, you know what I think it does is it takes the fact that I'm um, 40, uh, 41 years old and just thinks that you know a 41 year old american male always wants to see uh, garbage so anyway there's a safe search on now so hopefully there's still images that come up so um, yeah so you know you know when people do the r o f l r o f l does anybody know that in the chat no. is anybody uh, it's uh, rolling on the floor laughing right so that that's to crack up. That's just when you just cannot stop laughing. It's just like crazy laughter. Does anybody have any friends that make them just laugh to you almost cry? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I I did that before, by the way. Yeah, if if you, if you almost laugh so much that you pee your pants. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, not, too much. <laughs> not that much, yeah. you know. <laughs> not too much. Okay. I can uh, cry, cry, but uh, not this. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, no, that's 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 an expression, yo. I laughed. I laughed so hard. Yeah, rolling on the floor laughing. Uh, Ahmed has that on there. So I laughed so hard that I 
almost peed. I don't know. Yeah, how do you spell it? Anyway, it's probably wrong. My pants. Okay. <laughs> Okay, so so that's if you, <laughs> you laugh so hard. This so is come on, bit. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I know, but it's an expression. Is anybody is anybody accidentally peed their pants? They've laughed so hard. Anyone here? Nobody. Okay, well I guess people <laughs> don't really have funny friends. <laughs> No, I'm just kidding, guys, okay? Come on, this is a class on humor. Um, is anybody here, like, super funny to where your friend... It's, it's okay. Yeah, see, Ahmed said it happens. Is anybody here a really funny person to where your friends always enjoy you cracking up jokes and everything? Um, everybody's pretty Yes, I know my friend, one of the, my friends, she always cracking up for anything. Yeah, always, always cracking jokes. You're yeah. always cracking up when you're around him. Mm -hmm. Yeah, different stuff like that. Um, so, is isn't it funny though? Like some people, uh, some people get offended though. I think they get scared around people like that. You know. So anyway, anyway, it's yeah, always good to be around people like that. Yeah, and Shay, see, Shay's right. Shay makes me crack up, by the way. He's fu some funny stuff. He's talking about George Carlin. So George Carlin is just a hilarious guy. Um, just be careful watching George, though, okay? Because uh, I, um, he's very anti-religious, so that's fine, okay, um, if you're into that. But he might be offensive to some people just because of that. All right, it's all, it's all a matter of what... Um, what you can stomach, you know, but really funny guy. This would be a great guy for this class. <laughs> See, this is a good one, right? Look what he has here. Trying to be happy by accumulating possessions is like trying to satisfy hunger by, uh, by taping sandwiches all over your body, you know? So he has a lot of good quotes that are funny but also very true, okay? All right, does anybody have any questions on cracking up? Okay, let's go on to the next one here. So dry, dry. Uh, Ali, can yes. you can you read this next one? Dry. Yes. Uh, not obvious. Subtle sense of humor. Mm -hmm. So this kind of humor is kind of like British humor. Okay, it's very mm -hmm. dry humor. Sometimes you don't get it. Sometimes you don't understand. This is kind of sarcasm. Gets to be a little dry to be a little dry as far as the jokes, okay? So again, this is more like British humor. The English are very dry. Do you have it does anybody have any friends that have uh that have a real dry sense of humor they call it? I call it a dry sense of humor. Anyone? No? Yeah. Okay. I had some my friend he always uh, tell, jo tell jokes and uh, say hilarious words that you are gonna crab crab up. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but not not everybody will understand the dry sense of humor, right? They'll have a little bit of um, you know. It, it's just hard to understand the meaning of Did some you? of it. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah. Uh, Someone in school and get dry. Dry. Dry sense, sense yeah. of fun. Uh, dry who, don't, uh, who don't love with uh, jokey. That's me. Not everybody will laugh at the joke because it's harder to understand a dry sense of humor. And also, uh, a dry sense of humor is harder to appreciate. Um, you know, how do I, how do I put it? You, usually it requires a little bit more of an intellect in order to get a dry sense of humor. Okay. Someone, someone you like to look to him, by the way. Somebody what? You you like to talk to him a lot. I like to talk you, to who, who a lot. Yeah, when you feel when you feel comfortable to someone. Mm, I'm sorry. Can you can you explain that a little bit further so I can understand? Uh, when you uh, when you are comfortable to someone uh, like uh, like your friend or something mm -hmm. like that, uh, 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 
in the other way uh, when there is ugly man you don't like to talk to him in a way and uh, get away from him yeah this so I mean. well sometimes you'll use sarcasm which is very dry okay this is like a dry sense of humor in here so just keep that in mind when we look at sarcasm so I think what you're referring to is when you first meet somebody uh, and if you do or you know when you're getting to know somebody the jokes are going to be very understandable you won't show them your dry sense of humor at that time because they might get might not get that you usually share your dry sense of humor more when you do have closer friends that can understand your sense of humor. Does that make sense? Someone, yeah, yeah, Someone yeah. Will tell you that. Oh, here, wait one second. So let me. Uh, so let me hear Samir real quick, and I'll come back to you. I promise. What's that, Samir? I said uh, someone who told you the joke is uh, he don't uh, understand uh, the joke. And then you explain to him what does what the, does it mean? This this is jockey. That's yeah. So uh, so this is like a dry sense of humor. Sometimes with the dry sense of humor, you will understand the joke later on. You won't understand the joke right now. Mm hmm Yep. And and Nihon says a little humorless. So even that's like a dry statement that she's saying there, playing around, right? Okay, and what was that? What was that last part, uh, Ahmed? Um, I mean that uh, the dry uh, is the person who love who loves uh, laughing a lot. Or... Yeah, usually people people that have a dry. Well, it depends. Some people that have like an overall good sense of humor, you know, like a good sense of humor. Okay. All right, they might have some sarcastic jokes and just some regular jokes, kind of back and forth. Okay, um, but yeah, people that people that have a dry sense of humor, some of them are just dry themselves. They don't have like a good personality, and they'll just tell dry <laughs> jokes just because you know that's the way they are. Does that does that make sense? Yeah, yeah, and the opposite of uh, a silly man or or a hair airhead person. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Because a uh, dry sense of humor again. Usually, usually people are a little bit smarter when they have that dry sense of humor. Okay, so uh, Enrique, Enrique, can you read the next one here? Okay, the Google. Mm -hmm. To laugh a little without opening your mouth very much. Mm -hmm. Yes, when you have a giggle. Oops, why is it searching for Google? <laughs> I guess because I spelled it wrong. Uh, and g Google must think everything's giggle. So this is giggle. You know, just a just a cute little cute little laugh here. You know, not much of a big laugh. Kids are really cute when they giggle. Sometimes when you uh, when you tickle somebody, you know when you tickle. Mm -hmm. Okay, when you tickle somebody, like when you tickle their feet, okay, then they'll then they'll giggle. Okay, mm -hmm. tickle their feet. Okay, mm -hmm. so that's when they'll giggle. Like these little Care Bears are giggling. There you go. It's a little giggle. <laughs> so, um, how about you, Enrique? Do you giggle a lot? Um, not much. <laughs> Not much. I open, I open my mouth. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. So actually, you just giggled a little bit. <laughs> so <laughs> that's a little bit of a giggle, you know. Not much of a big laugh. Does anybody have any nieces or nephews where they tickle them and they're giggling a lot? You know. How about you, Omar? <laughs> do you Do you have any nieces or nephews? Actually, I actually, Brett, I have something uh, is really different about tickling. <laughs> uh, someone uh, I was leaving and uh, he put uh, like a firework <laughs> between my my finger. 
<laughs> he put fireworks between. <laughs> yeah. So yeah. he put a firecracker. Yeah, <laughs> tried so. to tickle me. <laughs> I got <laughs> that. That happened to me. Uh, was just trying to take care with me, but uh, I kicked kick his ass after all. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, they're lucky they didn't break, blow your finger up. Were you sleeping or something? Yeah, you, you yeah, must have been sleeping. It, oh my gosh! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's, that, 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 that kind of humor is almost a little sadistic, you know. Let's see, let's see if we have that kind of humor. Uh, yeah, that kind of humor is twisted. We'll, uh, we'll, we'll look at that. <laughs> it's still humorous, though. I, I like a little bit of uh, twisted humor. Every yeah. Now and then. yeah. So, okay, and, and guys, this is this is just the basic humorous, just funny, amusing, something that's funny or amusing. Okay, so um, uh, Hawini, hi, Hawani. Hello, Hawani. Okay, an impression, an impression. Do you know what? Can you read this? An impression. Uh. The act of speaking or singing like a famous person. Mm -hmm. Yep. Let's um let's go to YouTube and see if we can find uh find an impression. Okay. It's probably the easiest way. Uh, okay here. Let's see if somebody can do this. So yeah, this is where somebody tries uh, tries to do an impression of somebody else. Okay, Let, let's see how well this one comes out. Hopefully, the volume's up here. It means imitating in bread. <laughs> so, <laughs> this is Nikki Pitch. Yeah, you guys know her, right? Here, here, wait. Just, just so, just so some of you might not get the, might not get the context. Does, uh, Brett, does it mean also imitate someone? He had to imitate somebody. Let's uh, let's see if let's see if we can get to uh, to one of her regular videos. She she is annoying. I used to, I used to like her music. Yeah, sorry sorry about the language. So any anyway here we'll, we'll stop him, okay? <laughs> but that's that's somebody who's doing an impression, okay? Um, let's see. Does anybody want to see an impression of uh, Justin Bieber? Let's see if we can get Justin Bieber. <laughs> <That's Yeah. interesting. laughs> I'm sorry. I just I really don't like that guy. Um, oh, let's let's see what this person does. Let's see how funny she is. Uh, anyway, let's let's uh, let's get back to class here. I don't want to see too many of, them. but yeah, that's uh, that's when somebody does an impression. Okay, so um, is that <laughs> so? Nihon, that was kind of a kind of a torture there watching that. So, <laughs> does anybody here do impressions of anybody? Does anybody here? You guys ever impersonate like your dad? You know, your mom or something like that to your brothers, you know, maybe or sisters when you're younger. You ever impersonate yeah, yeah. Yeah, an aunt or an uncle? You, you yeah, like to I do mean, that, Ahmed? <laughs> I used to imitate my, my, my teacher when, when we, I was in the class. But when he, when he come, I can't do that. Or kick my ass, or kick me out from the class. <laughs> <laughs> How about is anybody else? Does anybody else here do an impression? 
Oh, come on, guys. Open up. Just tell me. You know? No one? Okay. Oh, so, uh, so hey, by the way, everybody in the chat, hello, everybody. Um, uh, yeah, I don't know what you're talking about with French language, come on, but that's okay. Uh, and Fatima, you should be able to find the recorded classes. They, they should be right there. Um, just, just take a look. Okay. Okay, so the next one here. Uh, Mika. Hi, Mika. Hey, Red. Hey, Hi. what's doing well? Doing well. Can can you do an can you do an impression of me, Mika? <laughs> no. 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 <laughs> no, because I have nothing in mind, so no, not now. I'll, all you have to do is go around to the students and just just pronounce their name improperly. That's the easiest way to do an impression of me. If you just if you just go to all the students and, and, uh, and just call them by the wrong name, that's the easiest way to do an impression of me. <laughs> that's pretty much standard for me. So um, so okay. So here here's the next one to kid to kid. Can you read this one, Mika? Pretty please. Oh yes, yes sorry. To make jokes, to joke with someone, to not be serious about something. Yep. We say, we say like to kid around as well. You know, they always like to kid around. All right. All of them are informal. Well, mm -hmm. more or less, aren't yep. they? Okay. Yeah, yeah. So kidding around. Well, I mean, all of this is is informal. You know. Yeah. So I mean, to kid around is just, you know, just kind of joke around, just kind of hanging out. When when you kid around, sometimes you use a little bit of sarcasm. Sometimes you can, sometimes you can be um, like making fun of your uh, your friends a little bit and stuff like that. When you kid around, you know, like if you if like if your buddy just got dumped by a girl, you'll kid around with them. Like, oh man, again. <laughs> like what is this the tenth tie this month? You know, you'll kind of kid around with them. So um, here I'll be a little sarcastic here. So um, so Nung, can I receive the link of the document, teacher? Um, yeah, actually I'm not going to be sarcastic today. Here I'll just give it to him. Okay. Do you have a favorite friend that you like to kid around with, Mika? Uh, yeah, with everybody. I mean, just because I'm like that. Not because I, I like to make fun of people, because I also make fun of myself. So yeah. Good, good, good. That's one of the um, one of the most important things is knowing how to how to laugh at yourself, right? Yes. Yep. And the older you get, the more that you master that talent, the happier you're gonna be in life. <laughs> when, you, when, you, when, you, when you start to realize just how many dumb things you do, you know, and you, you get rid of the ego, and you really just start to enjoy um, enjoy yourself for your mistakes, you know. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. that's one of the fun things. People take life too seriously, you know, and that's yeah. uh, that's not the way to go. Got to got to joke around a little bit. So, yeah. okay, is anybody here a big kidder? Is any? They also call that. He is a big kidder, okay? I don't even think kidder is a, a real <laughs> word, but people just use that. He's like, he's a big kidder. He's always playing it's, around. It's you, Brett. <laughs> it's me. It's <laughs> me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, I, li I like to joke around a little bit, you know? I mean, why not? Yeah. But, um, but uh, sometimes, sometimes it can be a little too sarcastic. And if you, if you haven't caught it, I do have a little bit of a dry sense of humor. So, which is which is good. And some jokes only I laugh at. But that's all right. So uh, yeah. let's, let's, <laughs> that's another thing too. So, so Mika, you seem like the type of person where you probably make jokes um, that only you laugh at that people don't get. Do you do, you no. do that, Mika? <laughs> no. You don't. You don't do that. You don't also have a dry sense of humor that sometimes you say things to your friends that are jokes that they just don't understand. No, no, I mean, yeah, they laugh when I make a joke, yeah, when I do a joke, mm -hmm. yes, but that do, would be so ever, sad. <laughs> but you never use any sarcasm or any dry sense yes, of humor? Yes, of course. Really so okay, good. <laughs> good, good. Sarcasm's, sarcasm is my best friend. <laughs> Unfortunately, <laughs> sometimes it drives away other friends. So, uh, so Minnie, Minnie, how about a stand-up comedian? Um, a stand-up comedian, a person... Oh shoot! I'm sorry. I switched on. No Go problem. ahead. A person who 
entertains by telling humorous stories and jokes, a professional comedian who perform on, performs live. Yep, okay. And I think, uh, I'm trying to remember if Will Smith does any stand-up. Like, Allah made, made me funny in America? Uh, say that again. Allah made me funny. Allah, say, say it again one more time. Allah made A L L U H, okay, made a me funny. A, I'm sorry. A. Okay, I, I'm gonna write it. Write mm -hmm. it down. Okay. Allah made me funny. Okay. Yours is in the regular chat, right? This is in New York City. Set up comedian. Okay. Is his humor clean? Yeah, yeah. It's how to uh, fun of yourself. Okay. <laughs> so. Okay, so this guy here, but clean, clean comedy, right? So yeah, so we'll watch a little bit of a uh, little bit of stand up. And you're saying there's no cuss words, okay? <laughs> here we go. Yeah. So good, at least it's clean. Yeah. By the way, he's Muslim, uh, Brett. Oh, no, no, I, I can uh, tell. I can tell. It was, yeah. it was talking about 9-11 uh, and how to get fun from these situations, uh, by, the, by the way. Yes, so you know what? What they're doing, what he's doing too is uh, he's using uh, using humor, okay? Um Ay, ay, ay. Why am I at a loss of words? Uh, he's using humor to cope with a bad situation. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. As opposed to, you know, I, I watched that stupid movie. Um, I don't know why I watched it. Um, here, Chelsea Handler is another one. I watched this stupid movie. Um, was it Zero Dark Thirty? And it's just... Oh, uh, yeah. Abs abs Talking about abs racism. Yeah. Yeah, I was just it was I was just like that's a, that's a really good way to just keep this um situation. So is this a stand up comedian too? Okay. So yep, another one here. Oh your favorite comedian woman? Okay. So let's see if she has some stand up. She she must be clean, right? Uh yeah. Is she Most is she, is she is she's she, American. Okay. <laughs> oh no, she's American. It doesn't mean she's clean. It usually means the exact opposite. Okay, let's just, let's just give it a shot. What are you doing? He's a human being almost. <laughs> so back to countdown. Hi, Stephen. Are you rolling on acid or something? I appreciate that. She, uh, so she met this guy, and he works at FedEx, and you would think he was like the tour manager for the Rolling Stones. She's like, uh, my boyfriend works at FedEx. I don't know if you guys know what FedEx is. I don't know if you guys are into FedEx. I'm into FedEx if you like to mail shit, you crazy bitch. Okay, <laughs> okay Minnie. <laughs> you gave me a loaded one, but that's all right, Minnie. No worries. <laughs> 
Okay, let's uh, let's go on to the next one. And yeah, and, and some t I've I've shown some stuff that has a little bit of a uh, bad language and accent. But that's all right. Um, okay, so silly Monsif. Okay. Silly adverb, funny in a slightly stupid way, funny in a way which is not really intelligent or sophisticated. Mm -hmm. So yeah, some people also call this kind of like goofy, when you're being goofy. Okay, that's another word for that. So and also too, you know, this falls back into where you're kind of kidding around, kidding around, being silly. Okay, just kind of a slight way, um, you know, of being funny here. And here, here's what we were talking about earlier with the firecrack situ firecrack cracker situation. And yes, Nihan, uh, foolish. So Nihan, uh, go ahead here. Twisted. Twisted. A uh, the one sick, disgusting, abnormal. Two, using sick or disgusting things in a humorous way. Yeah, but also too, it isn't. It isn't always completely 100% sick, you know, and disgust like so bad. Okay, some of it, some twisted humor um, can just be like sticking a firecracker in your friend's finger. <laughs> so, <laughs> that's a, that's a good one. Okay, so sometimes humor can get a little twisted like that. Um, but yeah, also too, it, it it can be to an extreme. People use twisted liberally. Or pardon me, in a very liberal manner. Okay, can kind of go back and forth. Okay, then the last one here. So witty, witty. Um, go ahead, Ahmed. Witty. It's me, Brett, or yeah, you're you're the only mm -hmm. one left. Your other your other buddy left. So. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I, can't, I can't mix them up. Uh, Okay, was it funny uh, in an intelligent way, full of fast, humorous responses? Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is when you have somebody that the jokes are not prepared, okay? And it's just a matter, you're having a dialogue, you're talking back and forth, and they just com continue to just throw out funny jokes, you know? And when I mean throw out, they mean, mean by say them. They also call them like zingers, Okay. And you're throwing out a bunch of zingers. Like, in, like uh, hiding in, in a darker place and get a sudden to the person. Uh, um, freak him out. No, 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 no. So witty, witty is just when you're having a dialogue and they can just create a joke out of anything. You know? They can just... Uh, just uh, yeah, like anything you're saying. Like maybe you're talking about a taco and uh, for some reason they make some sort of joke about a taco. You never know. Yeah, I mean, it, just really, uh, just do you, witty. Mean, do you know the the meaning of this word in Arabic? Mm -mm, what is it? Uh, uh, ash. It means <laughs> what? Alish, uh, alish, alish. Alish, alish. See, so <laughs> there you go. Here, yeah, but here, here's Mika. So that's that's. So Mika's <laughs> being witty. She goes taco. Mm, I feel like eating one now. <laughs> so that's, that's a prime example of being witty. <laughs> so very good, Mika. Very good. I'm glad you uh, glad you came to class. <laughs> See, there there's some use of you after all. Okay, so that's <laughs> that's a little bit of sarcasm. <laughs> or just, yeah. but that's also kidding around. That's when you kid around with somebody. You know, some people get offend, offended. Laurentino, hello, Laurentino. No. Glad you're here at the party. Not right, much. Thanks. Not much. I can I can hear in the background that you brought the party with you. Ah, uh, pretty much my ceilings. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> no, no, it's okay. It's okay. Just a little bit of humor. This is a class in humor, so I'm trying to be a little funny. So this is sarcasm. So this this is awesome. So sarcasm, though, please be very very careful when using sarcasm. Okay. All right, somebody can end up punching you in your face. No, I'm not. I'm just kidding. Not really that bad. But it does say that later in the document. But yeah, you have to be very, very careful when it comes to sarcasm. But sarcasm can be a lot of fun. Also, um, learn about sarcasm because sometimes people can be sarcastic to you as well. So you kind of want to pick up on it. Uh, Enrique, good Enrique. Can you start reading here how to be sarcastic? 
Okay. Uh, how to be sarcastic? Sarcasm is to say the opposite of what is happening at the time. It is a satire of humor usually used to make fun of some, someone. For example, you see your co-worker sitting down reading the newspaper and drinking coffee. So you say, wow, you look really busy. Obviously, your friend is not busy. You were being sarcastic. As the opposite of what you said is true. Your co-worker would probably feel embarrassed by what you said and, and, and other people listening might laugh at your sarcastic joke. Mm-hmm. Yep. Okay. So yeah, so like like it says right there, wow, you look really busy. You know, it's the exact opposite of, of what that person is um is doing or what they're actually thinking here. Okay, so here's here's another one. Uh, Brett, uh, maybe like Johnny Stewart? Oh John Stewart, yeah. So John Stewart on the Daily yeah. Show. So you know I yeah. really I really do not um like watching TV at all, but this guy here is just so funny, and I do I do watch mm -hmm. the Daily Show every once in a while. I'll admit it. So, what? Yeah, here he is, John Stewart. Am I spelling this wrong? Yeah, here we go. So this guy is really funny. He has some good clips when it comes to the when it comes to humor, um, and yeah, a lot of his is sarcasm when it comes to the type of humor. That uh, that he has on here, so very very good, very good. Okay, and let's uh, let's go on to the next one here. Laurentino, can you read here? When else uh, can we use sarcasm? Yes. Uh, when else can we use sarcasm? When someone says something very obvious, for example, your friend says, "I think that London is the capital of England." Now, everyone in the world knows that England is the capital of England, so your friend has made a very obvious statement. This is a great opportunity to be sarcastic. You could say, Friend, I think that London is the capital of England. You. Is it? Wow. Hey, Laurentino, thanks for bringing all the background noise. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But anyway, that would, that would be a little bit of sarcasm. <laughs> So hey, hey Lord Tito, it's like it's like crazy loud there. Okay, just uh, we'll, we'll get back to you. Um, so hey, by the way, guys, once we once the sarcasm hits on, please feel free to be sarcastic to me. Okay, no worries. I've I've done this class before. And uh, people are plenty sarcastic to me, so no worries. But uh, yeah, Laurentina, it, it is kind of loud. Uh, Mika, can you keep reading here, please? Yeah, yeah. like I could hear. <laughs> so <laughs> yeah, yeah. Here's another one. Thanks for being quiet. Your background noise is great. Good job. <laughs> so anyway, don't worry, Laurentino. Stay in class, okay? It's just just a joke. Uh, go ahead, Mika. Can you continue on with this, please? Where? I was telling uh, my father. Sorry. <laughs> Oh, hey, th thanks for paying attention. <laughs> you're welcome. <laughs> yeah, you're, you're always one of the best yeah. students. Yeah, I, I really enjoy students like you that, that lose where they're at. So, yeah, so sarcasm. <laughs> so, so, yeah, they're asking about kidding. Yeah, but, but sarcasm, though, look at sarcasm. Sarcasm, okay, so sarcasm is a form of kidding. All right, and you use sarcasm a lot, especially with your good friends. So, anyway, go ahead, Mika. Miss Genius, I'm just, I'm just kidding around. I know you could take a <laughs> joke. <laughs> you stay, have you figured out where we're at? Why don't you just rewind the video? <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, I'm just, I'm just kidding, Mika. Um, so yeah, where else? Okay. Yeah, when, when someone, and you can, you can always handle this stuff. You have a great sense of humor. When someone says mm -hmm. something very obvious, go ahead. Okay. For example, your friend says, I think that London is the capital of England. Now, everyone in the world knows that England is the capital of England. So your friend has made a very obvious statement. It's a great opportunity to use sarcasm. You could say, I think that London is the, I think that London is the capital of England. Oh my... Oh. Whoa, you're really intelligent. Mm -hmm. Good. Good. And uh, Nihan, I, I missed yours. So yeah, this is kind of like a kind of satire 
Okay, so you know when you when, um, <clears throat> excuse me, uh, you know because it is like making fun of people, you know, looking at you know maybe their shortcomings, different things like that, and yeah, sarcasm can also too be kind of like shaming people. So it is a form of satire. Okay, and yeah, I see everybody. Oh, I I know. Uh, and um, ah, yeah, yeah, I can never pronounce your name right. Um, I know you guys are being sarcastic in the chat, so good, so good. So yeah, also too, the one of my favorite things is thank you, Captain Obvious. Okay, when somebody says mm -hmm. something that's really, really uh, obvious, you know, like uh, hey, um, I, anyway, I can't even think of something right now. So or or like this, you know. Oh, you know, you can take class. Can we? Can you? You can take classes on verbling. It's like, yeah, thank you, Captain Obvious. Okay, <laughs> so let's uh, let's continue out here. Uh, the next one here, Minnie, Minnie. The next one here, when when somebody does something wrong. Uh, somebody does something wrong. Imagine that um, someone has done something. I cannot read it. Uh, Do you need imagine classes? that someone. I'm yes, just I, I'm I just have kidding. No, no, that that was a little bit of sarcasm, and guys. I'm just <laughs> going to joke around a little bit about the sarcasm, okay? So, so please don't take any offense. And I, I have a lot of you that know me by now. Go, go ahead, Minnie. Imagine that someone has done something wrong or made a, a, a made a made a mistake. <laughs> For example, your friend took a test and got a really low score time for some sarcasm. I only got 15% on my history test. Well done. I am very impressed. Okay. Uh, this is good sarcasm. Yeah, exactly, exactly. And Mika, yeah, or Micah, Micah's offended now. Hey, uh, hey, Micah, if you want to be really offended, I'll just pronounce your name again. Mikela. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. <laughs> if, you, if you really want to be offended, I just start naming people by their by their name that I can't pronounce properly. Mm -hmm. So, so what's that, Ahmed? And by the way, hey guys, listen, I'm serious. There's 15 minutes left with class, probably a little less. If you want to be sarcastic to me, I don't have a problem with that at all. It's okay. Feel feel free. Yeah. All right. It's all in good humor. <laughs> really? So, except, have, yeah. Yeah. No. Perfect. No. It, Except for you, uh, Ahmed, your jokes are never funny. So, no, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding around. Yeah, no, no, I'm, just, I'm just kidding around. You're, really? You're ex we'll, really? We'll make an exception for you. Okay. No, I'm just, I'm just kidding. Oh, don't cry. I'm taking a look. Okay. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding around. So, um, anyway, no, no, no. I always want to make sure. I don't 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 become offensive here. Um, okay, so let's continue on. Uh, Monsif, uh, when something unsurprising happens, imagine imagine that your friend went uh, to the Mon to a Monsif. Monsif, it's okay. Um, try reading the next one though. Okay, the uh, when some when something bad happens to you. Ah, okay. Sorry. Uh, okay. When something bad happens to you, when you get some bad news or when something bad happens. So you can use a uh, sarcasm. For example, when you drop a cup, a cup of coffee, a cup of tea, and the carpet, you can sarcasm. Uh, I don't know how you spell it. Sarcastically. Sarcastically. Sarcastic. Oh, great. Uh, say, oh, great. That's so cool. That's yep. All. Yep. And you could also say, um, nice one, butterfingers. Okay. So, anytime somebody drops something. That's a good time when you can pull in the uh, pull in the butterfingers. Let me let me show you this one here. So, somebody who has butter, you know butter. Yeah. Mm-hmm. See if it's going to show this. Okay. So butterfingers. This is like butterfingers. You know, somebody who has butter on their hand. They're always they're always uh, <laughs> slipping stuff. You know. So. You like know. catching fishes. Like what? Catching fishes when you like when you hold some fish and yeah, yeah, a lot a lot of fish. <laughs> yeah. yeah, so if you have, like fish in your hands and you're trying to hold on to them, 
Yeah, kind of like that. Now, how are they doing that? That's pretty incredible. Yep, a Butterfingers. Okay, so um, so yeah, all right. Okay. Also, too, like if like if somebody, <laughs> if your mom's cooking or somebody's cooking and they burn it, you're like, oh, great, this tastes awesome. Thank you, thank you so much. This is exactly what I wanted today. That's a, that's another one to use on them too. Okay. Nihan. Hi, Nihan. Nihan, am I pronouncing your name properly? Perfect. It was okay. very impressive. Yes. <laughs> you. Okay. Well, well, no, because, no. I, I because, said. because she, she is uh, the Turkish one, and uh, she, she said the truth. That's perfect one. Uh, with the H sounds a problem, Nihan, but uh, Nihan is the perfect. Nihon. Okay, and I, I went ahead and admit it was being sarcastic. Oh, that's perfect. Yes. <laughs> nice, nice job. <laughs> I am very impressed because you uh, pronounce very well all Turkish name in this class. <laughs> there goes some more sarcasm. Thank you very much. <laughs> good, good, Bide. <laughs> or is it is it Miney? Mine. <laughs> <laughs> So very funny, you guys. Um, okay, <laughs> go ahead. Just just read this one. I'm not even going to announce the names anymore. I'm just going to say it by people's faces. Okay, <laughs> go go ahead. When something unsurprising happens, uh, when something unsurprising happens, imagine that your friend spent a business job interview wearing shorts and t-shirts. You knew that he would never get a job dressed so casually. Friend, I didn't get the job. I failed the interview. You, what a surprise. Yep. Yeah, so this is, uh, again, you know, somebody fails an interview. Um, you know, uh, just different, different stuff like that. And like it says here, just be careful. <laughs> it does sound funny. But here it says somebody might punch you in the nose, punch you in the nose, and that should be it for that. Mm -hmm. And Brett, yes. uh, I want to share uh, something. Uh, in the previous uh, class, uh, someone said that uh, his boss uh, said to him, uh, if you uh, learn English, the pigs uh, can pl fly. The pigs can fly? Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so and he explained why he is in the class. <laughs> Yeah, Learning yeah, so, <laughs> well, we have the expression, sarcasm. yeah, when pigs fly, it's like, just like me, I'll, I'll be fluent in um, in Chinese someday, so people could say, when pigs fly, <laughs> 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 so that, uh, that'll be uh, be some sarcasm, so yeah, very good, so, um, okay, see this, <laughs> so good, Mine. <laughs> You guys are funny. Oh, thanks. Uh, hey, um, Ahmed, why is your name uh, Mikano in the uh, in the chat? <laughs> okay, so let's. Uh... No, it's a nickname. Just a nickname. Ah, okay, got it, got it. And I see a few other people have joined the class here. Just just so we're not mean to them. Um, uh, Ahmed Samir. Oh, good. Another student that can't find the microphone. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding, guys. <laughs> <laughs> just just what I needed today. No, I'm just playing around. Hopefully nobody gets offended by it. Uh, Kamel? Hi, Kamel. Yeah, let me just help these guys out real quick. We're in the middle of humor, guys. You're not supposed to jump into class. Okay. Kamel. Hi, Kamel. And also... Uh, Ahmed? Okay. Ahmed, just Hi. say hello. Hi. How hello. are you? Hello. Hi. Hi. Good. Good. Have you been, um, <laughs> are you, <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm just reading some of the stuff in the chat. Um, were you watching the class from the outside? Do you know? Yes. Do you know yes, here I about what this is about? Can I you, can you be class. sarcastic? Uh -huh. But I can you... don't know what about Okay, we well, don't. Yeah, don't worry. There's just a few minutes left. Okay, so maybe join the next class. Yep, it's okay though. But nice, nice oh. to meet you, uh, Ahmed Samir. Uh, Kamal. You're welcome. Hmm. 
Kamel, stop, stop moving around so much. <laughs> this guy, he's got ants in his pants. So Kamel, it's okay, Kamel. Just watch the class for now. Join the, join the next one here, okay? All right. <laughs> there goes Neon. Thanks. Gosh, sarcasm gates have, uh, have opened up. Okay, so good. So uh, let's see here. So here's some very famous, or not famous, but funny sarcastic quotes here. Okay, so we can take a look at a few of these. And I forgot who we left off with. All right, but some of these can be really funny and really good. Um, let's see here. Enrique. Hey, Enrique. I am here. I am here. I am opening the link. Oh, yeah, no problem, Enrique. Take your time. By the way, guys, feel free to click on the link and then share some of your favorite ones here. All right? Okay. And some of these, some of these you might not understand just because of because of this one. This one's real dry. The guy's name is Groucho. So no, Groucho is not my real name. I'm breaking it in for a friend. <laughs> so, um, uh, and how how do you feel about women's rights? I like either side of them. Right. Um, anyway, yeah, some of this is can be a little, a little offensive. <laughs> so, uh, Mika, what do you think of this one here? A child of five can understand this. Fetch me a child of five. <laughs> <laughs> so, hey guys, listen. Fetch there's, me there's a child of five. Yeah, fetch me a child of five. Like you can't understand. Hey guys, just just open up your microphones, okay? All right, go ahead. Just tell me. Uh, we only have a few minutes left here. What's some funny ones here? What's some sarcasm that you guys have? Does anybody have a, fa a favorite joke? And it better be funny too. Just, just warn you out of time. Anybody? Yeah, but Laurentino, Laurentino, be very <laughs> careful about Family Guy. See in the chat here. I'm just, I'm just saying, be very careful with Family Guy, um, <laughs> South Park. That type of humor, because those guys are extremely racist. Okay, um, you know, I just really, really, um, really be careful with that. Uh, so, Monsif, I never forget a face, but in your case, I'll be glad to make an exception. <laughs> What's oh, good? <laughs> oh, that that's great, Mika. So you could repeat after Monsif. You guys using the same brain today? I'm <laughs> oh, just kidding. <laughs> I'm yeah. Just, oh my god. <laughs> I'm just playing. <laughs> well, they say two heads are better than one. Maybe a shared one is good too. What's another one, guys? Just go ahead. Turn on your mic or turn off your microphones. Let it fly. What's another one you have in here? And there's there's a few more on these other pages that are good. But yeah, but these are all these are all sarcastic quotes here. Uh, you have delighted us long enough. <laughs> Maybe a so, good listener is you. A good listener is usually thinking about a good listener is usually thinking about something else. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, I like everyone very... here. <laughs> I like everyone here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, uh, <laughs> because my glass is so bad. Well, thank you, Ahmed. <laughs> no, 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 okay. no, 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 no. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Anyway, well, hey, yeah, no, no problem. But by the way, um, after this one, excuse me, you have the getting annoyed pet peeves, and this kind of falls in a little bit of humor and also some somewhat pain. But okay, guys, well, hey, I'm gonna end this class now. Yep, thank you, Captain Obvious. <laughs> I want to say thank you, Captain Obvious. Yeah, the Captain Obvious is a good one. I forgot where it first came from. Okay. Yeah, please, please don't call me Captain Obvious. So um, anyway, everybody, I'm going to end the class now. Another one's coming up, and there's a, 